Check my boy. Just to say it too. While you're near the entrance to South Haven Forest, could you please go check out reports of a dark eco infestation there? It seems someone is still experimenting with dark eco. Go if you mine. find infected plants, you must destroy them before they spread. There are some ancient precursor pillars in the forest that may have a link to the catacombs. But if the battleheads overrun the place, we'll never know for sure. Make me proud. Oh, I friggin' metal engine cage, you're taking over the city, everyone's life is at stake, and you're worried about the fucking plants. You expect Jack to take his sorry ass all the way over and put weed killer on them. I.e. Green Eco. Which I suppose is interesting because Jack 2 didn't really reference any of the different colours of Eco, but uh, this one does now, you know. We're gonna get some green eco. Jack, you can kill those plants with your jet board. What the fuck? Just scoop up green eco energy and then lay it down. Who the hell are you? Who are you? I don't recognize your voice. Yeah, it's Kira. Right, I've cut most of this out, by the way. I just cut it out because it's kind of long and that in the post commentary. I just made a bunch of jokes about Jack and Kira being married and that Kira told Jack to go weed the garden and he didn't want to and shit. And there's the jump cut and we're about done. So yeah, you didn't miss much, don't worry. And here's the pillars. They right, work, Jack. Those precursor pillars are some of the oldest artifacts we've ever found. Ma wrote that there were some ancient ruins to the west that were activated by five special artifacts and revealed wondrous truths. I'll see what I can find out. Right, this is weird. We've just learned about these pillars and they're apparently very crucial. And what's even weirder, once we take our reward... Yeah, now Daxter can go on both shoulders. As soon as we get off here, it's like it goes back up and our goal is to go back up it again. But to do that, we need five Precursor Artifacts. No, not the same three Artifacts from Jack 2. These are completely Jack, different. We've located four critical power junctions, and if destroyed, could drop some of their shields. Our band expert, Jinx, can blow the junctions if you can get him to each one and protect him while he's laying the charges. You remember Jinx? He's waiting in a vehicle outside. Happy blasting. No, I don't remember Jinx, but some of you probably will. Anyway, let's go. And here, this is really weird. Wait and see what happens when I get out of here. If I get out of here. Also, this Haven Forest sucks compared to the first one. First, no, I hit my microphone there. The first one was a lot more calming and green, you know. This one looks like autumn, and it's just not as calming. I don't think. Right. But yeah, that mission that... Oh crap, my head's in. Oh, what the fuck, I'm not even holding a gamepad. Uh, that mission that Torn just told us to do, it activates as soon as you go out here, and it doesn't really tell you clearly, but you've got to make it over to the green dot on the radar right away. And if you don't, you die. See, look, you just heard Jinx's voice. Where the hell is he? I'm just thinking, if I could just hear him, isn't he near me? But he's all the way over there in the green dot on the radar. And if you don't make it over there, you die. And when you respawn, you're right next to him. So it's kind of pointless. Here I am going to try and make it over there, but... <laughs> right. Let's just get this over and done with. Get in, Jack. Here's me mo this is me moaning about it right now, in case you're wondering. Right. Hey there, pretty boy. You ready to rock and rumble? No, I ain't ready to rock and rumble, you ugly boy. Okay, so yeah, we just gotta... I remember this mission being really hard, but I actually did no bad with Dana. Don't know how. So yeah, you just gotta defend Jinx as he uh, does this. Yeah, it's actually you know what? This is kind of long, and this is all you do. You know, it's just nothing really interesting happens. That you just defend him while he does four of these. I think I'll cut this out. I'll cut it out. I'll be right back, guys. Okay, I'm back. 
Uh, one thing I forgot to mention actually, I got a precursor orb on this mission and I unlocked one of the secrets. I unlocked uh, more yellow ammo, you know. Nice work, Jackie boy. I'm gonna go see what I can scrounge up. See you on the flip side. So yeah, now we've got more yellow ammo and we got ourselves the last blue ammo thing, which is actually really, really cool. Check it out. Ashlyn here. Jack, we've got word of a shipment of eco being delivered somewhere in the KG city section. I think it's worth stealing. I want you to go in and find the vehicle with the eco, then drive it back out to the naughty Otzel in one piece. I'm sure they'll try to stop you, but we need that eco for the war effort. Remember, don't lose the shipment. You don't need that eco, you just want it for yourself. You're no better than... Nah, fuck it, I'm not gonna talk about that shit. But yeah, we gotta go get ourselves some eco and whatnot. Uh, it's not far from here, so I didn't cut it out, you know. Okay. And it's one of the strangest missions ever, actually. And I cut quite a bit of it out, because I did die quite a bit. Come on, hurry up. Right, watch carefully. Let's go. Those rocket launcher thingies just magically appeared. Now it's all weird. There's red arrows telling us where to go, and where are the rockets, you may ask? Look how close they are. And they're meant to stay like that. I was actually like hanging off the X button there. Right, I cut ahead to this part, the port where you're supposed to go, and this was bullshit by the way, because the fucking, the timer at the top is actually extended because I died quite a bit, so Naughty Dog were making it easier for those of us who've died a lot. That's lame Naughty Dog, fuck you! But yeah, that's, like I said, I did smash into this shit quite a bit. Uh, but it wasn't a matter of time, it was a matter of me being crap, so it's not helpful at all. It just makes me feel bad. But yeah, like I said, died a lot, cut it out, this is where I succeed. Right, we have two missiles left, but there's only one more decoy! We got one more missile, and no more decoys! Drive toward the night yacht, so we'll use the bar sign as the last decoy. Alright. Wait, what? You can make it. Crank that sign up to full brightness. Hang on, Dax. It's gonna be close. <laughs> My beautiful monk! Oh, lol. Right. Time for another mission with Torn. I don't know what I'm saying there. I just stood still for a bit. Jack, we've got word of a new assault on the port. They're trying to take us out once and for all. The strange thing is, we're seeing movement from both the KG and Metalhead fronts. It's like they're working together. We've got to repel this assault or we're through. I hate to do this to you, but I'm putting you on the front line. You're my go-to guy. Stop any KG or Metalhead units from reaching this place. If we lose this one, we're history. Yeah, and once again, Torn does absolutely nothing. Right, I did fail like once on this, and I did cut it out, so yeah. Not sure when I did, but this is what it is. It's just sitting here with this fixed camera angle with unlimited ammo, admittingly, uh, which is good, but you're not allowed to use your uh, other guns, which is odd. And I know I'm, I know I keep hitting my comrades here, but as far as I'm concerned, they're just highly colored things on the map that I'm supposed to shoot. Bright red, bright blue, I don't care, I'll shoot it. And they just picked up a gun there that'll give me a limited supply of uh, blue bullets. 